efforts to achieve the much needed transformation the nation is entitled to. This message was delivered by the head pastor of the Living Faith Church Worldwide, David Oyedekbo Jr., during the inauguration event of Dr. Jackie Kasim as the 42nd president of the Rotary Club of Ota. Details in this report. The recent 10-day protest against hunger and poor governance has brought the quest for effective representation and leadership in Nigeria to the forefront. Speaking to newsmen, the guest speaker asserted that a rewarding life stems from a life of service and that leadership must begin with each individual. Acknowledging that God often calls people to greater responsibilities, the speaker challenged the leaders across all sectors to increase the level of service and dedication. I think leadership starts at every level. Leadership begins with every individual taking responsibility at the various scale. Obviously, those who stand in what seems like a subjective position tomorrow, I mean today, sorry, are the leaders of tomorrow. So we must take responsibility at every single level in order to see the change that we desire to see as a nation. So it starts with every individual. In her address on the nation's state of affairs, the new president called on the country's leadership to reduce the cost of governance. However, she urged Nigerians to be more patient, emphasizing that the nation would eventually recover and improve. Everybody is hungry and all that, but the thing is, we have to be very patient. We've been patient, but we have to add more very now, because by the time things we start turning around, everybody is going to smile. I hope. That's what we're promised, and that's why we like to hold them accountable for the promises they're making to the people. So it's just a matter of us understanding one another and trying to love one another, because that's what is missing in Nigeria right now. We have lost the love we used to have for one another. And once that love starts coming back, we all start seeing things in a very different ways. Nigeria did not get here in one year. So for us to get out of this, it's not something that can be done in a year. So we all need to support the president and also believe that uh, for any changes to come to Nigeria, we must uh, also be hoping for a change and be ready to stand up for the sacrifice that comes along with the change. Dr. Kasim said the body is committed to impacting lives and as such, under her leadership, impactful programs will be initiated. It's a matter of taking some people off the street again, giving them something to look forward to, giving them a hand job whereby they don't have to rely on the government. They can always fend for themselves. We, at least when we're talking, we're talking about as many as possible, a million, two million, three million, only God knows. Around the Ota, actually. Everywhere, around everywhere. Everybody that is around Ota is not only an Awori, is not only a good state person, but everybody generally. Highlight of the event was the official handover to the new president. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.